you are in the market for a bike or an e-bike, we've got you covered here on Talk of the Town. We've got Jimbo who's joining us. He's gonna talk a little bit about sports addiction and what to expect over there. Nice to see you. Good to see you again. So we got some things to talk about. You know, you really are in the bicycle sales and service business. Let's talk a little bit though for our viewers who like to support local about talking about shopping rather in a bike shop that is truly an official bike shop versus you know, a lot of us who are used to going to the big box department stores, shopping online, what do you do differently? Yeah, it's just like your experience when you go into a bike shop is like immediately we're gonna try to categorize you and what kind of riding you're gonna, you know, what type of riding you're gonna do and, and what, what kind of health benefits are you looking for. So we'll get you the right type of bike for the right kind of riding. And that's the biggest thing, because you go into an apartment store, one, you're not talking to anybody, you're just picking something out, you don't really know what you're, what you get. I mean, we have so many people that do that, and then, you know, half a year later, or two months later, they're upset about what they got. But, yeah, fitting you to the bike, getting you the proper bike, is probably, it's, it's, it's big now, because now, more than ever, there are bikes out there that are more comfortable, easier to ride than there were 15, 20 years ago. Yeah, and you know, in my experience, there's really only maybe a handful of bikes that are right for each individual. You may not even know that you're riding a bike that uh, isn't as good as it could be for you and your riding style and your size and all of those variables. So yeah. having an expert to talk to makes a huge difference. Well, the biggest thing you said, size. You see so many people riding bikes out here and they're the wrong size. Mm -hmm. I mean, they have different sizes in different wheel sizes. So you got different wheels for different types of category of riding and then every one of those wheels represent has the different size of bike. So Absolutely. size is huge, big and, and super important. Absolutely, so you can talk to an expert and make sure you're in the right size bike among other things. Let's spend a moment talking about inventory. Obviously the pandemic has created shortages in so many industries. How is inventory at the store? It's great, we were super, I was super, um, super aggressive 18 months ago, so it's paid off. I mean, we have, we have more bikes in inventory now than we've ever had at both stores, the barn and at Sports Addiction. So inventory is good. Obviously, there's some thing, you know, you're buy, I'm buying so much stuff worried about what it's going to be. So to answer your question, it, it's tough because you don't know what the supply and demand is. So you mm -hmm. have to really put your put it on the line to go ahead and just order as much as you can. and and. You know, I've got storage units all over the place holding bikes right now. There Just you go. Wondering what the spring's gonna be like, but it's been great. But that's good to know for our folks who are shopping and, and thinking about buying spring bikes that you can get inventory, you have inventory, it's there. You are ahead of the, of the curve, if you will, yeah. on ordering, and not everyone has done that, so kudos to you there. Uh, you also sell electric bikes, which is something yeah. that I really enjoy. Let's talk about that. Man, they've just, it, they've taken off. It's probably the, the, the largest thing that, you know, other than pickleball, <laughs> it's the largest sport that's it's taken off. And, yeah. And then there's people that have this, this, this thing about, well, you're cheating or whatever. But what it allows you to do is it allows all these people to ride places they've never ridden before and go out and, and exercise. And, and do things that they couldn't, they can't do now, or even just a very active person like myself or you that wants to get out and go places that, you know, 30, 40, 50 miles or whatever, and enjoy it and just use 10% of the effort right. and, and, and move along, so. It does, it actually, it changes the scope of the trip you're able to do. So you, you could still, you know, potentially burn the same amount of calories, get the same amount of exercise, but go such a great distance that you wouldn't necessarily think would be a biking distance. Yeah, because you've got two types. You've got just pedal assist bikes and you got pedal assist bikes with the throttle. Mm -hmm. and it's like a gentleman that bought one yesterday, you know, he said, well, yeah, I want a throttle because I want to throttle to the places I've never ridden ride those loops and then throttle home, which makes sense. Yeah. It, and then you just got the basic pedal assist where just, you know, you got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50% help. But like you said, you still have to work out. You still have to pedal the bike. So absolutely. It's good. Well, it's kind of a thrill too. I will I'll tell you, I enjoy my, my e-bike ride, uh, even sometimes yeah. just around the neighborhood. Yeah, But great. Uh, for folks who haven't been to the stores, give us a, we got our head to break here, but give us some quick landmarks on where you're So Sports Addiction's out at OKT Village, out there by Sun City, next to the food line. Been out there for 10 years now. It's a 10 year anniversary this year. Congrats. And then we have Old Town Bike Barn and Adventures down in the promenade, just down, down, you know, downtown Bluffton, right there in the promenade promenade um, it's just a little small just 
you know, service bike sales and um, bike rentals too. So there you go. Well, um, good, but yeah, two good spots. Like, yeah. Congratulations on you know a long time in business and a great practice. Thank you so much for sharing a little bit about this with us today. Yeah, thank you very much. Nice yeah. to see you. And we have more talk of the town coming up next after this break.